The Disability Royal Commission's report has been described by advocates as a turning point towards a fully inclusive and non-discriminatory Australia. However, they emphasised that although the recommendations are promising, they need to be followed and people with disabilities should be given space to manage this process. Among the 222 recommendations made to governments are working to eliminate discrimination in workforce. Education and housing systems work on workforce. Education and housing systems to eliminate discrimination establishing a First Nations Disability Forum by March next year A First Nations Disability Forum will be created by March next year. Disability rights law will be created mixed emotions as report marks turning point during Royal Commission hearings Disabled people detailed their horrific experiences of assault harassment and torture. Jordan Steele John. The WA Senator and Greens disability spokesman who played a key role in setting up the Royal Commission said it must lead to change. The disability community has done our part. Now it's time for the federal and state governments to do their part. Two, he said. Violence and abuse continue. The government's work is just beginning and society remains united in our call for urgent reform. Key peak bodies representing disabled people described report as beginning of journey to an inclusive future but said suffering experienced by many disabled people needed to be acknowledged. Groups that signed the joint statement included the Australian Federation of Organisations, Children and Young People Advocacy Network Australia, First Peoples Network. Inclusion National Ethnic Alliance. Disabled Persons Australia and Women Australia. Today, we choose to make space for our community's trauma and pain in the spirit of healing and restorative justice. The statement said, we want a disabled-led future for disabled people. Without us, there is nothing about us. Damien Griffiths. CEO of First Peoples Disability Network. Paid tribute to those who provided evidence. As well as those who could not. We need to remember all disabled Australians. Well as disabled First Nations people who have a result of abuse and neglect, he said. The Royal Commission has shed light on some dark places in Australia. Timetable for First Nations Forum will be important Mr. Griffiths welcomed the Commission's recommendation to urgently establish a First Nations Disability Forum and said the creation of such a body is long overdue. Received and 1,785 special sessions were held the forum will bring together First Nations people with disabilities, their peak body, the FPDN. Aboriginal Community Controlled Health Community Sectors and Government. The Royal Commission found that First Nations people with disabilities are uniquely marginalised in Australia and face barriers to accessing supports, including the National Disability Insurance Programme. The Commission described this as systemic negligence.